Following his visit with Lieutenant Governor Brenda Murphy that marks the official start of the campaign, PC leader Blaine Higgs laid out his pitch to voters, toting fiscal restraint, population growth and increased health care spending. We got us here and we feel very proud of that. We want the opportunity to finish the job and we have a team assembled that represents this entire province to do just that. Higgs is looking to become the first premier to win three straight elections and consecutive majorities since Frank McKenna in 1995. But standing in his way is Liberal leader Susan Holt, who hopes to harness discontent over health care and the cost of living. We're listening and you're telling us it's time for a change. Meanwhile, the Green Party, led by David Kuhn, hopes to make the leap from third party holding three seats in the legislature to government. To my amazing candidates and their volunteers, when they say a Green government cannot be elected in New Brunswick, flash a big smile and keep knocking on those doors. <laughs> Recent polling data suggests the election will be close, likely coming down to a handful of urban ridings. Higgs faces some headwinds with 12 incumbents opting not to run again. Over the past 18 months, he's dealt with resignations and an internal push to replace him over his leadership style and changes to school gender identity policy. More recently, he's clashed with Ottawa about its push for provinces to welcome more asylum seekers. In response to questions about his more recent focus on social issues, Higgs says that he, unlike other leaders, is willing to dive into tough topics. But I think it's important that we are able to talk about issues that many people are just afraid to talk about. Higgs says he doesn't want this election to be about him rather about the progress that he's delivered for the province over the last six years. But after six years in office, opposition parties say it's time for the electorate to have their say on his leadership. Silas Brown, Global News, Fredericton.